hello everyone and welcome back to my channel it is the favorite diamond paints and crafts also known as myra um welcome back if you are new welcome to the channel i hope you enjoy today's video let's get into it um today we have a diamond dots unboxing and i've never gone over the box i noticed that on this box it's a the imaging is a little different so that's why i kind of wanted to bring it up so on the back of the box it does give you a couple steps instructions um and the contents of the kit um on this side it gives you the full image of the portrait this one is called riviera dream um it is a partial but as you notice on this box, it doesn't show the diamonds on there very pretty for some reason, like it should here, like it does here. Um, I did discuss on clearance for uh, 1997 at Joanne Fabrics. So let's go ahead and, oh, on this side, it does give you the entire portrait and the design size, which is 66 by 47 centimeters. On this size, it's giving you the pasting area. So that's all you have to do. You don't have to do the ocean background, the birds, any boats. It's going to be fun. It also gives you the number of colors. There are 27 different colors in this portrait and the dots count. So it's saying that this portrait is going to take 26,121 drills to complete. So let's get into it shall we i hope everyone's having a great day oops the side is open what about this side <clears throat> all right let's see here what you got for us today i like partials I'm actually working on a partial right now, but it's a Diamond Art Club partial. But I do like my partials because they go by pretty fast. And since we tend to collect a lot of Diamond Arts, um, I try to get some that'll make me, that I can go through them pretty fast. So I can go through them quickly so I don't stockpile so much. Uh, that's the attempt anyways all right so drills we'll go through that here in a second um that says add some sparkle to your world by diamond knots yeah i like going to joanne fabrics and seeing what i can get uh, discounted or on clearance i'm more than happy to pick up something on clearance let's unroll this this is a little bit stiff so i'm gonna roll it the other way remember we can do this because this is poured glue come on work with me there we go there we go yes it is a great sunshine day here in south florida there is no rain on the forecast I think I might be taking a dip in the poo today. Dip in the poo. I forgot to check it before I came in to do this. Oh, the instructions are gonna pop out here in a second. Yep. Wow, this one's really stiff. That should be enough. It shouldn't be that bad. Here, let me show you guys the symbols. They're pretty good symbols. I don't see any issues. There's a lowercase n, a higher case n. Arrows. See, there's an arrow going up. That kind of pointing arrow going to the side. That one going to the other side. There's a V, a little corner, a check, and a V. So sometimes you gotta go over it because sometimes they can be confusing. 
So you gotta check. Check, 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 check. Check, my check, check, one check. Wow, this is pretty. Oh my goodness, this is so pretty. Let me see if I can get it all the way in. Let me move my cup of coffee. Put these drills over here. Can I get you all in? Mm. This is about as good as it's going to get. So yes, this is a partial. So this area in here where it has the homes and the mountains, the sky, the boat, this tree here, this bird, these trees, this here, and the ocean and the sky, you don't have to do. Everything else is, yes, diamond art. You have to put the drills on here. It looks like it's going to be very, very pretty. Oh my goodness. I love this little bench. I love these little pots. Flowers. And it's got tons of pink in it. Hello. I love pink. It's going to be awesome. So let's get in to the drills to see if this came with any special drills, any ABs. And then we're going to see uh, where they go. So this one, let's see. You know what? I haven't measured a diamond knot in a while. Let's see if it's true to size. Um, let's see. At the bottom here, it does say 66 by 47 centimeters. You always go by the design size, not the fabric size. So let's see. Oh, got my hand a dandy tape measure. If you hear any noise, I do have a neighbor that is working on his Mustang. So, please bear with me. So, from pasting area to pasting area, it is 65 and a half centimeters. So, it's basically there. And then let's do the other side. And see the pasting area here. right on the line and this goes to it's 46 and a half and this is 47 so that's fine that's true to size I don't have any issues with half of a centimeter that's going to be perfectly fine and to get this put up in our house it's going to be beautiful oh I love this let's look at the symbol quality on here. Let's look at these beautiful pinks. So I don't know if you guys can see it. Let me see if I can pull my light over here a little bit more. But some of them sometimes seem a little blurry to me. Like those little plus signs. But the green is coming out perfect. And the hot pink comes out perfect. So for me, I guess it's probably just my eyes. Where the lighter colors are for some reason a little bit of an issue for me. But the darker colors, like here, are perfect. There's nothing wrong with the symbol quality. I can get, see those perfectly. I don't need a light pad to work on that. So I'll probably, but here it's perfect too. Let me get you guys down. This is all perfect. P's, sevens, slashes. I call these little microphones. Holler. Everybody's got a different name for these little symbols. Um, but I like this. This is really, really pretty. So the symbol it quality is very good. I don't see any issues with it other than um, some of the light ones. Like I said, I that's my issue. That's not y'all's. I mean, unless you guys have the same issue. <laughs> so let's put this, fold this over just a little bit. And we're going to go over the drills. So it does come. Apologize for the noise. Okay. So it does say Riviera Dream on the back. And let's get this open, shall we? Sorry about the noise. Alright, 
So your tool kit, your basic tool kit, comes with a tray with a spout, a squishy for your drill pin, and some wax to go in it in a little round container, and some baggies. Um, and here are the drills. Ooh, look at all this paint. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. So let's start with one. Where's one? It is the pink. Ha ha ha. Alright, so it looks like we have different, three different shades of pink. This is like a fuchsia, a little bit lighter. A little bit lighter pink. Ooh, a baby pink. See, look at that, four different pinks on the first four. Awesome. Peach. White. With this kind of scenery, you're obviously going to have lots of greens. Are these the same greens? Yes. These are different greens. All four of these are different greens. It's very pretty. And let's see. I'm not going over the code for the diamond dots. The Like this one's 8248. Because they're not as well known as the DMC code. So I try not to do that with the diamond dots. Ooh, there's a pretty lime green. These beautiful yellows. That cell. This is gonna be fun to work on. <gasps> Blue! Beautiful blues, a couple browns. This looks like a plum color. I don't know if you guys can see that. This one looks like a plum color. That's very pretty. Very pretty. We have another yellow, gray, some brown. This is like a seaweed. I think, in my opinion, oranges. Ooh, pretty, pretty, pretty. Orange. I love that color. It's beautiful. So it doesn't look like there's any A, Bs in this portrait, which is fine because I do have um, yellow A, Bs. I do have pink A, Bs. I'd have to find which one would fit this. Um, I do have a green, but I think it's a lighter shade of green that I have in my stash. See, I have this pink one, which might match with one of these. These are ABs that I purchased separately. I don't know. Might go with that color. Let's see. What else do I have? I have this orangey color. It's like an orangey red. Mm, not really close to anything here. Um, let's see. What I have in my stash. I have... This one from Diamond Dots, 125, but we don't have, well, yeah, I can put this in place of this. There's some ABs in there. And I also have some sparklers that I could throw in, which that would make it look pretty because it is an ocean scene. Here's the green. Let's see if I find a green. Yeah, if I have a, that's why I can't get these if I have a portrait that doesn't come with any ABs. I try to see like this one. I can replace for this one. This is a really pretty color. I could choose that one. So I can have ABs that I can throw into the portrait. Here's a yellow. I could probably do this one. Yeah, that would be a good match. But to see where that yellow and green and the white. So... It's going to be number 11 and 12 and 6. Put this away. 11, 12, and 6. So let's see where I could put those. If it's going to make the portrait look good. So I'm going to move this because it's lifting the portrait. Not looking pretty. 
11 and 5 and 6. So 11 is the green arrow pointing to the left. All right, so that's this symbol. Green arrow is pointing to the left. So I would have some ABs in this area. Um, 12 is a dash. I would have a couple ABs here, some here, a little bit on this post. So yeah, I think that's a good decision. It's not gonna be too much. There's some here on this side. There's some up here in the foliage of the trees. That would be good. And then number six, which is the white, would be here on the post. And some in here on the bench, some here on the flowers and up the post. So I think that would be just enough ABs to do it. Um, I wish the pink would match, but I don't have a pink right now that matches the four different pinks that are in this portrait. But I will have to do a post review on this one and see. Oh, I just noticed this lantern. That's beautiful. That's so pretty. This is going to be a trip to do. I'm going to love doing this one. Well, if you guys have done this portrait and you completed it, please attach it below. I'd love to see what it looks like. If you have any questions or concerns, please don't hesitate to ask them or, or put them under. I will respond to all comments. Um, also, if it's your first time coming to my channel, welcome. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit like. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you get a notification every time I post a video. And we'll see you guys next time. Thank you. Have a good one. Bye.